define t equals to square root of x. Therefore, we get dt over dx equals to 1 over 2t. Then, dx equals to 2t dt. The lower bound and upper bounds are t equals to 0 and t equals to 2. Question is now in t domain and it can be solved using the i table. Select 2t for d and e power t for i. Derivative of 2t equals to 2 and no change in i. Then, derivative of 2 becomes 0 and integral of e power t still the same. Now, q equals to 2t multiply e power t minus 2 multiply e power t for 0 until 2. Putting t equals to 2 into the equation and then minus putting t equals to 0 into the equation. We get the final answer q equals to 2 multiply e power 2 plus 2.